Hello YouTube. Welcome back to the Secret Underground Bunker location. I'm your host, Cav Trooper Munoz, and this is an unpackaging video. I picked up this little gem at the gun show, and uh, there's a huge selection of gear and bags and equipment at the gun show so this one just kind of stood out to me because i was looking for a replacement for the tackle box that i usually take to the range with me i was looking for a range bag and i didn't want it to be over you know, overly huge i wanted to be something that i could uh wear because i didn't want to have my hands full when i'm trying to grab a couple rifles or a handgun and a rifle and you get the picture uh, this came in handy because it has a strap to wear over your back and I like the amount of compartments so let this let's break this bad boy open and see what it's got okay so one thing I liked about this was the number of separate pouches you've got a small pouch here and then another pouch I'll tell you what I'm going to do I'm going to open all these zippers because it is hard to hold this camera and uh, get all these things out and you can see by the tag this is made by VISM shooters gear which I've never heard of so uh, All right, took a little break to get all these zippers open, and I gotta tell you, this one thing that struck me about this bag, it seems very well constructed. It has liners in the each individual pocket. It has mole uh, attachment here, and it's got a couple of these pouches, which I would assume are mag pouch uh, magazine holders, but, uh, you, you know, you could put a knife in there. I might strip these off and put them on my other on my other bag. But this thing, you know, here's you have this compartment here. You have a smaller compartment. You have a compartment on the bottom, um, and then you have this. It's misleading because you have another top pouch here compartment on the flap. That goes over the main compartment look at the size of this main compartment this thing's pretty beefy i mean that's that's a good size main compartment it's got two sections to it so and then again it's got you know you could stick a small bladder in there and uh have a hydration pack so uh and then also i must have missed this zipper it's got just behind the uh, main compartment, it's got another large compartment. And if you look at this, the back is padded. It's got really generous padding here. And it's got this snap compartment. with another compartment behind that. I mean, you could, well, you could definitely fit a, a handgun in here, and there is also um, hook and pile tape liner in there. So if you had a holster with a hook and pile tape system, it could, it could uh, ride in there securely. Um, once again, uh, you could put a small bladder in there. Uh, there there's a, just a ton of stuff you could do with this, this bag. And of course, what kind of bag would it be without a place for your morale, your best morale patch? So, uh, if you like having a morale patch on your bag, uh, there's a place for that. So you have the, uh, shoulder strap 
with a padded shoulder rest, which isn't, you know, all that beefy. Um, but one thing it does have is this type of grip to it. So uh, I suspect that'll stay on your shoulder well. Uh, whereas a lot of these bags I see, they they don't have anything. So this uh, pad could slip off your shoulder and then it becomes more and more uncomfortable. So I'll uh, continue to review this bag as time goes on, but I suspect that this has been a very good buy. This bag I got at the gun show for $30 and I just couldn't pass that up. They had it in black. OD and uh, desert so uh, I got the desert one and uh, I think I'll be happy taking this bag out to the range and replacing my you know tackle box with it because there's just there's enough space in this bag for just about everything I want to do and it's not overly cumbersome or overly sized I, I don't look like a mall ninja with this thing so this is Cav Trooper Munoz, and this has been my review of the VISM. Uh, I don't know what you call this, but it's their shoulder bag. And if I find a website for them or any other information, I will annotate it in the notes below. Thanks for watching, commenting, and subscribing.